Hello again everyone. Welcome back. Uh, today is July 4th of 2017. I want to wish you all a happy Independence Day. Thank you very much to all of our active duty service members. We appreciate your daily sacrifices and thank you very much to all of our veterans, both who are with us and who are not. We appreciate everything that you have done for this great country. And today, as Americans, we should all look back and recognize the sacrifices of many, many people who have built us up into this great nation that we enjoy today, where our freedoms are so abundant. And, you know, just can't thank you enough. So I decided, uh, you know, what's more American than apple pie? Well, hopefully an apple turnover, because that's about all I had. <laughs> um... I got one of these Bridgeford products. Uh, Cabela's sells these in these interesting packages, you know, with these nice little scenes on them. Uh, now, I did cut into it already. Uh, I wanted to get one of these warm, so I had a spare heater. Um, so, yes, Bridgeford does make a line of, like, dessert-style uh, foods. Uh, this one is apple turnover, as I said. Uh, nice little... You know, these little sandwiches, they're, pre they're pretty darn good. I actually have had a lot of good experiences with these. These are great to take on the trail with you. Um, do have generally about a three-year Best Buy shelf life. We have a you know an end date of February of 2020. I bought these this year, so these would have been manufactured this year. Uh, so like I said, about three years is what they recommend. Now, could they last longer? Possibly, but, you know... Sometimes pushing your luck's not always a good thing. So anyway, apple turnover is what we got, and a, a little bit here on them, I guess. I'm just letting my mother's sandwich heat up a little bit. If you can see this, uh, 330 calories for one of these little sandwiches. That's that's a, that's a pretty big wallop. 400 milligrams of sodium, actually quite a bit less sodium than most uh, most of them for that calorie content so per calories here you're getting a lot less sodium with one of these as opposed to a lot of entrees but a lot of sugar 22 grams of sugar five grams of protein you know so like i said pretty decent little thing but has a laundry list here of ingredients uh but anyway enough yak and let's get our pie out pie out of the proverbial oven so to speak hopefully this uh yeah i think that head up pretty good as a matter of fact I uh, I had also recorded an O'Meal uh, review today so I just took that uh, heater that comes with those which are so nice despite my reservations about the actual O'Meals and I just use it to kind of heat up these because they, they do last for quite a bit quite a bit longer than uh, <coughs> Than uh, you know, like a standard MRE heater. Just put a little, little napkin down. I guess we're real fancy down here. So anyway, let's break this open. It's it's lukewarm. It's not super duper hot, but you see, yeah. Oh man, that does smell really good. Hmm. Get a big old whiff of that cinnamon and apples. That's nice. Let's go ahead and take a bite. Hmm. Pretty darn good. For as much sugar as in it, mm, yeah, I don't know. It's not super duper sweet, but you can, I mean, you can tell. Apples are, you get a couple bits of apples in there. They're not completely mushy. They still have a little bit of a texture in there, which is nice. bread's nice and soft. Heating these up is definitely the way to go, by the way. <laughs> yeah, very tasty. I have to try more of these. This is actually the first one of these dessert-style sandwiches that I've had. And they make quite a few of them, actually, so. But anyway, yeah, that was the Bridgeford uh, Shelf Stable Apple Turnover. Warmed up. I just want to thank you all for stopping by. Thank you to all the subscribers. You know, we uh, we've been having a really good run of things. Just had our first giveaway, and we're still gaining more subscribers. So, I appreciate all of you that have jumped on the ship. 
Uh, thank you all to the you know the likers, everybody who likes the uh, the uh, videos, everybody who sends their comments in. I like reading from you. It's 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 nice. It's kind of like hearing from <laughs> you know back in the day people had pen pals. Now you have uh, YouTube buddies. <laughs> I don't know. But it's just kind of nice to hear from people. You know, we have uh, people from different countries and so forth that comment. And I think it's really neat. And here on uh, on America's Independence Day, I just want to thank everyone. And uh, I hope that uh, that all of you are uh, enjoying this day. And for those of you who are working, y'all are some real heroes. <laughs> I used to have to work all the time on, on every holiday, so I understand how it goes. But thank you for everyone. Uh, I just appreciate it. God bless the USA.